Hello friends, welcome to another video of Hybrid Academy. In today's video, I will create a small gadget which will actually be helpful mainly to electricians but it can also be helpful to other people and even in small regular home use. For this, we will need a 3 pin plug top like this. I need a small cap, something like this, a holder, a piece of wire, two small nails, two old sketch pens without the felt tip. I have already cleaned them. I have removed the uh, inner part of the sketch pen. Just the body of the sketch pen and of course some regular tools, screwdriver, cutter etc. So let's start. So first thing what I've done which I've already done is that I've made two holes in this cap. This is a cap and I've made two holes and similarly I've made two holes in this three pin plug top. Now these two holes come in sync with each other. You can see it like this. So if I place it over this, it comes like this. So these, this I've already done using the soldering iron. Now let me just open this three pin plug top. So you can see there are two holes in the cap. So initially what we will do is that we will divide this cable in approximately two halves and I've kept a small piece separate. Let me just cut this out. And a small piece of cable like this. So I'll just peel the rubber part of this from one side. We will open this holder, take this complete body out and we'll connect this to Just make sure that no loose part of the uh, copper cable is out because that may short with the other part. So this should be properly tugged in. And then you can tighten the screw. So this is connected on one part. Now I'll take this one part of the cable. I'll peel the one corner of this. and we'll put this in the other part of this holder. Again, make sure no copper cable is out and it should be properly tucked in. Tighten it as much as you can. Okay, now this is done. Now what I will do, I'll pass this cap through this, like this. I'll pass the wires of this holder to this cap and you can see that I can put it like this we can use very quick to paste this cap on over this So I'm using very quick to paste this and we'll have to hold this for some time so that it sticks properly. So I've placed a rubber band on this so that it sticks properly for some time and in the meanwhile let's do the rest of the things. We will take the other cable, we will peel one corner of this. We will put the screw from between this. This is actually a nail, not a screw. And we will tighten this up somewhat like this. And we will press the copper cable so that this tightens up. Now we'll push this nail through this okay. the hole of this hitchman is a bit narrow so the 
nail is not going in i'll use the other one to broaden this up hold it with the plus pliers let me try once again here it goes so one part of this is ready so i've removed the rubber band and you can see this has been properly pasted now we need to connect the back of this 3 pin plug behind this so we'll pass these cables through these holes let me do this from the longer one first this one is done and let me pass the other one also so we'll paste this behind this cap somewhat like this we'll do this later through fevi quick and as of now i will first peel the corner of this lengthy one again and we'll connect this nail in this as we did the other one so i'll divide this into half tighten this up i'll use the plier tighten this and then we'll pass this through the body of this sketch pen so we have both the pens ready one corner one cable is connected directly to the holder the other one is like this let's peel this part as well this is a bit lengthy so i'll first cut this off and i'll peel this part also so now we'll connect this small cable in one of the screws of this 3 pin plug i'll provide the cabling diagram separately so one cable from this goes into this the other cable directly comes out and now we'll use the other lengthy cable this one which had the sketch pen on one side and we'll peel the other one and we'll connect this to the other pin of the three pin plug and then i'll connect it this and we'll tighten this so you can see this holder comes in series with both these pins and it's connected like this tighten the three pin plug first and then we'll paste this even this has come out the fabric was not sufficient to hold that so we have to basically hold it like this we can either use fabric quick or what i will do is i will either use some other glue maybe m seal to stick this up let me try fabric quick one more time cables are basically pushing it apart we we'll have to hold it like this for some time so the fevi quick was not sufficient so what i did is i used m seal to fix this up properly so now this holder is properly fixed with this 3 pin plug and these are the two wires these are the two points and the circuit is like one cable is directly into this pin and the second one is routing through the bulb holder so once the bulb is fixed the circuit will be complete and we'll have to join this to glow the bulb so this will actually help us to check the connectivity so 
I'm connecting this plug over here and I'll fix a bulb on top of this like this and once I turn it on connect these two together the bulb will glow so these two points can be used to check the connectivity or to check the series if the series is complete now suppose I wish to check this and I wish to check if this cable is fine or not so I can simply connect these two together and yes the cable is fine similarly if I wish to check this cable this is also fine now if the switch is working or not I'll turn it is off and if I connect this okay this is off now and I'm turning it on this is fine this is fine these two are not short this is not short so this can be used to check the connectivity or the series of a network and this overall becomes a very handy tool just a plug with the holder this complete is very handy to check the series of any circuit this is the overall tool I hope this will be helpful to all the electricians to check the circuits and their connectivity and they don't have to carry the bulky extension socket along with them to check the connectivity. This itself is sufficient tool. Thank you for watching the video. If you like the content, please like the video and share the video with your family and friends so that they also get benefited with this knowledge and information. Please do not forget to subscribe to our channel for more such informative videos. Thank you, take care and stay safe.